Okay, so let me quickly walk you through the process. Mm -hmm. Let me quickly walk you through the process of uh, doing your screen share um, using Canva, doing your screen share using Canva. So the first thing you will have to do is to go to um, canva.com. So we are already here. So you just go to canva.com, then you, you log in. Then that brings you to the uh, workstation or the dashboard. So now you are here at the dashboard. This is fine. Then you want to proceed to creating a video. Okay? Because this video recording so you have to create a video so what you have to do now is to come to the create design then you can choose um, a video you want to create you can either you can also choose presentation or just go for video so if you're choosing presentation that means you'll be making use of some exist existing templates to work with but if you're making um, video this doesn't require um, template so let's Let's go for the option of the video first, then we'll see what will happen with that. Okay, so that will open up in another window. I'm going to continue from that um, page. All right, so welcome back. So what we do now is this. As you can see, this page, this page is loading up. We have just created a, a new um, video template. So as you can see, there is nothing here now. So first thing you do, you can just apply a background. So you come to the um, element or design tab, or you can even choose a color from here. Let's add a color from here so that it shows we are working on something. So. You can pick any of this color. Um, I like using this. Okay, for this, you can pick any of this. So that is done. The next thing you you want to do to start yourself from here, you can put in a text. Let's say I'm just adding a heading to this place now. Okay, I think my next, okay, so oh, I have multiple headings here. So this is it. So I, I can just put this one as tutorial. Please follow these steps so that you'll be able to, you know, do the same thing at your site. So this is just tutorial, okay? So then we proceed. What I want to do next is to create another tab. And this tab is where I want to put my video. So to put your video here, that is to record yourself and share your screen. You just come to upload, upload, then you click on record yourself. If you have an existing video, you click on video here. This populates, you see all your existing videos. Um, but we are more concerned about recording ourselves. So this is where you come, then you click on, you have two options, either to upload a file or record yourself. So you click on record yourself. Then you wait for the prompt to appear on the screen. So um, this is not coming up because I'm also, okay, so now it's up, it's up and running. So you can see, now, from this point, you come to this camera and screen. That's this particular side. You can either choose just camera only, camera and screen. Then this pop-up will ask you um, which of the Chrome tab you want to play. Then this is for you to show all your entire windows. Then this is just the entire screen. Okay, so you can always pick either the Chrome tab. So you use the Chrome tab. You use the Chrome tab. Then you come to, um, let's say, uh, I can just pick on this Trello. Okay. I can just pick on Trello and let's see what we have there. 
I'll, I'll come pick on King James Bible and see what we have there. So you can see. I hope this is clear now. You can see it's showing you my screen. Then from here, you can now click on the record. Okay, you can now click on the record. You can put, you can move this to any position you prefer, either down here or up here, not to cover the major part of the screen. So that's just the step. Then once that is done, all you just need to do next is to click on save and exit. Click on save and exit. Then it will automatically save and then you can exit the, the app. So once you click on save and exit, then you can go to your file, then download. So if I say record now, it's going to give me a timer, then it will start recording. So let's say I'm done now, I click on done. Okay, then I'll come here and click on save. When you click on save, everything will be um, uploaded to this. You can see the upload going up. Then you cannot click on share. To click on share. Uh, then download. So, so just wait for this to become active. Okay, so you download. You can see it's rendering. Once the rendering is completed, then it will ask you for location to save your file. So that will come up in a pop-up window. So it's still rendering. Sometimes the rendering can take a lot of time, maybe like five minutes, 10 minutes, depending on uh, the duration or the duration of the video. If it's a very lengthy video, maybe like 10 minutes, 15 minute video, it can take almost like 15 to 20 minutes to render. So this is just a short video, so you can see. So I can just put two tutorial. And I will just save this. And that is all. So the file is saved. Thank you.